my name is Dr. Knott, and this is Contrast, and we're going to resume our game today. So let's just, uh, you know, how do you say, resume it. Uh, here we are. Okay, sorry for that silence. I was just trying to remember what was going on. Act 1 of all the gin joints. So we're following Johnny. Who's Johnny, you may ask? Well, if you didn't watch the last episode, Johnny is our father. At least the girl's father, because I'm not sure how we relate to the girl yet. Except that... He just went through the gate. I bet he's going to the bar. I bet he's uh, going to the bar. Mommy said Daddy left us. But that's not true, is it? She kicked him out. Yeah, I think we are, you know, we are the girl's imagination version of ourselves. I'm not quite sure. It won't open. But mm. you could break it open. You're pretty strong. I am. Oh, Mommy, okay. <laughs> Alright. So, I mean, like, obviously, see, we can interact with things like lights and gates and whatnot. So we're, we're real, but we can't, we're not seen by other people. So I'm not sure... Not That's sure. the amazing Vincenzo. He's a world famous illusionist. What's Daddy doing with him? So we should be okay. We're not going to be seen. Oh, we can't see anybody though. So how are we going to do this? Come on, Vincenzo. It's just some film footage of your act. Why can't you let me borrow it just overnight? Because it is my new act and it's top secret, which is why my agent has it safely locked in his office upstairs. I just want to show it to my investors. They want to get to know you better. Mr. Fenris, I have performed my illusion act for the King of England and the Emperor of Japan. There are untouchables in India who tell stories of the amazing Vincenzo. If your investors don't know me, they're not in show business. You think I can't pay you? Look at this suit. I'm staying at the Excelsior Hotel. I've asked around about you, Mr. Fenris. People tell me not to trust you. And I've asked around about you, Mr. Amazing. You're not as flush as you look. You've got a few debts. Which is why I think you'll perform at the opening night of my circus. You dare accuse me Look, I made a beautiful poster. Now I just need to borrow your film reel. Until I see some earnest money from you, I'm damned if I will lend you the time of day. All right. I'll get you a check. Cash. Cash, don't worry. I'll call you tomorrow. It's been such a pleasure meeting with you. Thanks for the drink. Hmm. All right, investors, show business. Typical stuff, you know? Find the film reel in the jazz bar, which is what I think we were just looking up at. Now, of course, this place doesn't have stairs. That would be too convenient. So, instead, we shall do this. Did I just hit my head on this thing? Oh my god. Okay, there we go. Okay, that thing's blocking us. Let's get out of it. Hmm, drums. So we cast a shadow, too. It's, it's kind of bizarre. I'm trying to figure out how, the, how this is working. So, obviously we're going to have to go up. What is, oh, what is this? Oh, we changed this. Ha 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 ha. So what I need to do is alter the direction. There we go. Preferably, it's something like really close and like right there. Like that. Okay. Good call. And then we'll go in here. Ah. Ah. Yes. What the? Can I jump here? There we go. There we go. And then I think we're probably going this way. Find the film re reel in the jazz bar. Yep, yep, yep. Wait, wait, wait. This is out? No, here we go. Oof, like I said before, this is a little this is a little clunky. Can I get in here? Not really. 
I'm still trying to sm oh, we need to go over there. Chuck. Still trying to smooth out the camera deal here. Is there light across this? Wait, 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 wait. There is light across this. Silly me, I almost walked across. Oh no! Oh wait, that was just a luminary. Oh, that works. But I think I still need to go that way. Uh, okay. So going back. So can I go just right up here? No. Where's the door? Yeah, I think what is this? Why are we so clunky? That's my good girl. Huh. I mean, the, the there are some things in this game that are really cool. Like, I really dig that. There's another luminary. Like, the storytelling is pretty cool with the the shadows and stuff. It's just thing. The hell? Oops. My God, it's full of stars. Achievement unlocked. I guess you can just walk off the world. What is that? How does that even make sense? What is happening here? This is weird. Cabaret. Yeah, I just, oh my god, the camera is so difficult to control. Alright. Ooh, Gentleman's Club. Alright, I think we have to go, so we, we can't go through the front. We went through this way last time, yes? Okay. Daddy's gonna get into trouble without that movie reel. We have to get it for him. Okay. Well, I'm trying to figure out how to get through. Th oh, that's just the other side of that. Daddy's gonna get into trouble without that movie reel. We have to get it for him. Oh my God! I'm gonna get sick. <laughs> What's this? The great Vincenzo. Vincenzo. Okay. Cool. That is a pretty cool poster, I, I will admit. How did I just do a 180 with the camera? That is nutty. That is actually nutty. Jump in here. Okay, I almost have to like recontrol. Nope! <laughs> there we go. Turn the camera, turn my self around, go this way, and fall out, there we go. Now, oh, maybe I have to, do I have to get to the other side? I do, let's check out here one more time. I'm pretty sure I have to get to the other side. I don't think we're on this side. This is just a drop. This is very unsafe. The handrail just stops next to this chair. Okay. Very unsafe. Now, let's try this. Oh my. Oop. Be careful. Be very careful. Oof, there we go. Managers, yes, they're not gonna be able to see me. I can go wherever I want. Before we do that, let's go see what everything else is about here. So we got another luminary, and then we'll check this out. Saint Clair Daily Gazette: No smoke, no mirrors. The amazing Vincenzo hides his secrets in plain sight. Newspaper article: The amazing Vincenzo has his secrets. Whatever. Um, I see the word alleged right here. Can we zoom into this? I'm clearly missing things here. We did miss in one room because we, we did the, the story part first. Like we, if we did this... Why am I gonna check it off? Uh, if we did this part first, we would've not gotten 
that object. And we do that in like, the first room we were in. So, bring the reel to the cinema. Whoa. All right. So don't need to interact with that. We'll just keep that really close. And we'll head out. Where's our little, yeah. Thank goodness. You. Now we have to get the movie to I think he's going to the cinema to meet his friends. Mr. Fenris, I have performed for the king of the universe. There are monkeys who know about the amazing Vincenzo. Your investors haven't heard about me. They're stupid. Oh no, there's no way to get across. Wait, why though? Why is this town like this? If we could get the spotlight working, then I could track you with him. But it's out of power. We need some luminaries. How many? Do you five? Have any? Does five work? Why? She doesn't seem concerned that this whole town just got like rocked by an earthquake or something. What's going on? One, two. Got it. All right, you're gonna help me. All right, how does this help you? If you show up on the other side, though, kid, I'm a little. I'll be a little freaked out. Let's go. Whoa! Sh no. Okay, I got gotcha. you. Don't worry about it. Go slowly. Jump! No. <laughs> what? Why? She's really good with the spotlight, though. Wait. Where, where did we... What just... Where are we? Why are we over here? She's over there. Why are we over here? And jump across this way? Nope. That's weird. I feel like that's not right. Okay. Let's go back. I feel like we should not have shown up on that side. Is this the right way? I don't remember. Why is it so jittery like this? Okay, yeah. All right. So what we should what should happen is we walk across and see if I can shift out. I should be able to shift back in. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Why am I starting way over here? That's bizarre. Running back because they're making us do it. This camera's gonna make me spew it. I'm like a rapper without the rapping part. I can barely rhyme, I guess. That's how I'm like a rapper. Jump in. Okay, see how we just jumped in like that? That was so easy. So, I'm stuck though. Okay, okay ready? There we go, Vincenzo. Let's run out. Okay, got it. It's too far. Can you help me, please? Okay, good. I'm glad. If she would have just shown up on our side, I'd been like, oh, sorry, what now? Yes, I know the new ability. I've I've been told about the new ability. Uh, <laughs> I'm like floating. <laughs> Holy! Okay, someone tell me what is happening on with this town. This town is messed up. I definitely was floating. That was funny. Thank goodness it was such a big jump. Fudge! <laughs> Don't put me back. Okay, good. If they were gonna put me all the way back to that other spot, I'm gonna run all the way back and Ugh! this camera. All right, what do we got here? What's the collectible? Is it a ticket? Due to change in management, we are currently closed for business. Our apologies for the inconvenience. Interesting. What's up, yo? Oh, it's locked. Oh, wait! Didn't get to just... I told you I was good at fixing things. <laughs> Don't even worry about it. Oh, this is freaky. Maybe you could find another way in. I mean, we're pretty damn skinny. All right. I see what we have to do. 
We can make a little bridge here, and I'm guessing, let's see. He's gonna have to go this way. We move to the side here. He's a good, like, uh, step stone, you know? And then she's blocking our way, and that's no good. Nope, not the one I wanted. Not the one I wanted. Not the one I wanted. Come on this way, come over here. Yeah, sure, whatever. There we go. And this lady. That should do it, yeah? Okay. So now, if I slowly turn... How do we get... How do we actually get up? Oh, you know what we could do? Hmm. I think we had to actually run up. But I think... How high can we jump? Oh, I see. We have to use her as like a pedestal. From the ground, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See? Like... That, maybe? Now... Again, we're skinny. So. We're very, we're a lot smaller than I thought we would be. Okay. On this type of, this type of thing here. Here we go. They're cool puzzles. It's just a bit chonky here. All right, Rapid County Penitentiary, uh, Oops. I didn't mean to do that. There, okay. So, FT Bonjour, Bonjour. I don't know. I don't do French well. Saint Provost. FT. What's that? I don't know. Uh, down here it says Prison Release Johnny A. Fenris Crime Passing Bad Checks. Ah uh, ha ha. So, good call on uh, Vincenco, whatever his name is, to not. Take a check. So, record of John A. Fenris, number 44963, alias Johnny Mac, race white. Crime, passing bad checks, class C felony. Sentence, one year, six months. $800 fine. Received at penitentiary January 6, 1922, from St. Clair. Date of sentence, December 11, 1921. Sentence begins December 26, 1921. Maximum term ends July 6, 1923. Minimum term ends January 6, 1923. Good time allowance, 250 days. Occupation, Bible salesman, age 35. Action of parole board, release conditional on good behavior. And then criminal history. So on April 15th of 1908, I think that's like a, a number sign, 1358, DC St. Clair, change, petty theft, and then four years, four and a half years later, postal fraud. Okay. Oh, got it. So our dad, or her dad, Dee Dee's dad, is petty criminal. Shift in, what do you mean? I walk through this glass? Oh. It's cool. So, I'm guessing, let's just walk normally. I'm gonna assume we walk normally until otherwise Dee Dee. specified. What are you doing here? You're not supposed to be out this late. Where's your mom? Did mommy really kick you out? Were you spying on us at the cabaret? Are you coming home? <laughs> That's my plan. I've got to convince your mother. Is she here? No, I snuck out. <laughs> oh boy, you're growing up fast. You used to be scared of the dark. But did she really kick you out? Well, yeah, kind of. At the time, I wasn't being very good to her, so I guess I had it coming. I missed you so much. <sighs> I missed you too, honey. But I'm going to come back home. I'm putting together a circus, see? It's going to pay for everything. And you know who it's going to star? The amazing Vincenzo. <laughs> How much snooping around have you been doing? Yeah, it's going to star the amazing Vincenzo. He's good, huh? Look, you're really not supposed to be out this late. I'm 
I'm gonna take you home. I brought you the mail. Shh, shh, shh. But shh. Uh, I got a couple of investors coming here, and they don't like kids much. I need you to run home by yourself, okay? But I brought you. Didi, you have to get out of here. I won't tell mom you snuck out. Okay, go. Hey, Carmine, Silvio. He doesn't have to hurry to show them. His name is Salvio, so why are we here? Salvio, yeah, what did I say? I got great news. Vincenzo is in. You have to show them the hurry. You got him? You're sure? Sure, I'm sure. He's gonna play opening night. Really bring in the crowds. So that's why you brought us here, huh? You're gonna show us his act? Yeah, yeah, except uh, the projector's broken. Because if you don't got him, your circus is going to flop, and you're not going to be able to pay us back. And then I'm going to have to break your arms, and then we'll see how well you swim. Look, I'm going to need just a little more money to uh, finalize things with the chance. Are you kidding me? What'd you spend that money on that So Listen, it's all going to come back to you. Oh! Show them the movie. Show them the movie. Uh, I'll just go real slow like here so that he gets his ass kicked, but okay, what do you want me to do? Go in there, okay. That's not where I wanted to go. It's a weird little patch of light here, he's just still getting punched. Yeah, punching bag achievement. Well, I don't know, I mean, what do you want me to do? How fast do you want me to go? I got an achievement for punching bags, apparently, where he's just getting there <laughs> sacked the whole time. <laughs> Ay, ay, ay. Where are we going? How do you want me to get in there? I ask out loud. Do I make a shadow? Nope. nope. Can I run through that beam? I wonder. How do you guys like this? I'm jumping on your shadow. No, it doesn't quite really work, does it? And the beam's completely gone. He's just still getting punched. <laughs> Alright. Can I hop in here? No. The reel onto the big screen. Well. Oh. Doink. Jesus. Guess what? There's another shift out. I'm trying to. There we are. Oh, oh, you broke my finger. Oof. Oh. Hey, knock it off, Sal. Check this out. Jeez, he is amazing. <sighs> I told you I got him. You didn't okay, do anything yet. Go get your money. Thanks a bunch. That was really fast. Well, why don't I swing by tomorrow? Pick it up. Relax. Let's go have a drink, huh? I know a guy who'll fix that finger right I, up. I can't. I gotta go meet someone. Boy, you're in a hurry, huh? She must be a real ripe tomato. <laughs> you wanna go meet Johnny's tomato, Sal? I like a ripe tomato. That tomato's my wife. Always wanted to meet the wife. Huh? We'll play canasta. Just the four of us. Canasta. Hmm? Okay, but... He's not asking, Johnny. He's telling. Alright, a few observations. One, Vincenzo is not that impressive. I'm still watching him. He's just, what is he, like, uh, he's not, he's not doing anything. Two, yeah, I think that guy got punched a bit much. Three, it's Vincenzo, not Vincenco. And four, we're going to stop here, because it just saved. And next time, we're going to go see what happens, because Didi just ran off, and she's not supposed to. She's supposed to go home. She doesn't listen to anybody. Uh, so, thanks for watching. Pick it up here next time. Take care. Goodbye.